Hey everybody and welcome to my channel. I hope everybody is having a fabulous day today. If you are into bags just as much as I am, then you're going to be obsessed with my channel. So don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And if you want to bug you almost every single day, hit that little bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. You can also follow me on Instagram and Snapchat. It's at joshi.michael. So today we're going to be talking about this Dooney and Burke wallet that I just picked up and how I am disappointed with it. But first, the lip gloss of the day is this. It's Butter London. This is like one of my faves and it's in the late night. I, don't know, I always say date night. It, it just confuses me. Late, late night. But I always call it date night. I don't know why. But I love this. This is like one of my faves. So it's a good one. All right. So I did want to, okay. I brought this down because I wanted to show you because I was, I was using this. This is the Law Shop. Um, Essential wallet in the full in a uh, cobalt leather with a gun metal. Okay, so I got this just the other day from Dooney and Burke, and I, I was using this, so I just put, I took everything out of here and put it in here. And I want to show you, like, the sizing is, like, exact. They're, like, exactly the same size. Um, this one looks better because they're stuffing it now, but they are, they're literally, like, exactly the same size. So I want to show you that. And even the layout, um, they're both a button, like it's like a button situation. So let me kind of just show you. So the layout of that, and then we got the layout of this. So you can kind of see, I just have some kind of random cards and stuff in here. Um, but I want to talk about a couple things. I'm disappointed with this. I loved it when I first got it, and then I switched my stuff out of it, and I'm like, Ugh, it's it's got a defect on it, so I'm gonna return it. I might get, I might exchange. I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I I haven't decided yet. But this is this one's going back for sure. Um, one thing that I don't like about this, also besides the defect, I like everything about this wallet, like the size, the layout of it, and everything. It's great. I just don't like this back zipper pocket which I do have changed, I did throw a change in there, because I don't like this little dingling, dangling thing. It bugs me. I don't know why it bugs me, because the, the Long Shop one doesn't, but it still has the change compartment on the Long Shop one. It's just, it's just built into here. And actually, this one's bigger. You can get, you can just get in and out of there easier. So it's like, I really don't need this wallet, but I really liked it, because I thought it goes with my bag. It's black, it's cute and everything. So I could live with this, but that this little change compartment, it's its very tight, it's its pretty tiny, but I mean, it, it works, it's fine. I'm just disappointed in the defects, which I'm gonna show you right now. So I loaded it all up and it's got all the slots right there. And I have everything pushed like in. All the cards, they're all pushed in as far as they will allow. But I want you to see something. See this problem here? Do you see that? So this stitching here situation, I don't know if they, because the stitching looks good, but for some reason the interior of this particular pocket, it it slants, it's slanted. Like the, it will not push any more than that. That is, that's it. It's all the cards are in there as tight as they'll go. And that is what bugs me because they're not even. Like this side's pretty even, I think. I mean, actually, really, this this pocket here should be should have been just a little bit deeper too, because this is kind of sticking out. This one here, that Cole's rewards card thing. But the pockets, okay. So basically, both of these pockets are defective, or it's just not sewn right, or whatever. Is this one sticking out a little too far? This one's way too far out and it's slanted because it's going in farther here at the top and not so far in here because of how it's like folded and stitched and glued and whatever. So that bugs me. I just can't open my wallet and look at something and it be slanted like that. I mean, it's totally slanted. It's not cute. Actually, let me take out the card. I want to see what the leather looks like. Oh, I'll just take all of them out. Screw it. I'm sending it back anyway. Actually, the whole panel's crooked. Let's look at it closely. This whole panel is actually 
it's actually, it is crooked. See, it's slanted. See how it's all slanted? That's not right. Um, you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and take everything out of here because I'm returning this, so I might as well just go back into the long shop one. Um, and then there's the, there's like, there's a slip pocket here and then a slip pocket right here. I, I just have like coupons and receipts and stuff like that in there. And then your bills, they do fold um, like completely. Uh, well, you see that. So you can see all my millions in there. But no, it, it fits in there really nicely. It's nice and you can lay them out and it's still really compact, so. But um, yeah, I just wanted to show you because I, I was so excited, but now I'm disappointed about it. And do I, I really don't need it anyway, so it's it's fine. Like, I'm just gonna send it back. I just don't really need it. I do have something else that was supposed to be here today, but apparently, I'm like knocking over boxes. It's not gonna be here until next week or something. I don't know, like everything's like, shipping's all backed up. I don't freaking know. I don't know if, yeah, actually, both uh, both sides, everything's slightly slanted on, if you look at it, I don't know if, you can, if the camera is, like, transmitting it, but they are completely crooked. Both sides are crooked. So that is just not going to work for me. Other than that, like, I really like, I like the layout of this wallet. I like the leather. It is really nice. It's, um, the pebbling is a little bit bigger than the... Than the Longchamp one. Um, the Longchamp one feels nicer, actually. Yeah, the Longchamp. This one. This does feel nicer. It feels. It. It just. It just does. And nothing's crooked in this one. This is perfect. Okay. So bummer about that. I just wanted to show you because it does hold a lot of card slots and everything. So I don't think I. Nope. So there's eight, nine, ten, well that's ten slots, there's five slots on each side, which is nice, and then your bill compartment, and it's, what a shame, what a shame. And there's no glazing on this, and there's a little glazing on this though. So for the price of this, I, I don't remember what it was, it was like a hundred bucks, hundred and I don't know, I feel like it was a hundred and something dollars. I think I actually paid more for this because there was no sale going on. Oh, I got, I did get 10% off, but, and the Ebates is like, or Rakuten is 4%, it's something stupid, but anyway, I actually think I paid the same amount for this one because I got it on sale as I did for this one, and the Longchamp one is definitely a higher quality item. It just feels higher quality, and obviously looks higher quality and everything's straight, but this is a really good comparison. This is a really great size. Um, this is very comparable to my Gucci one that I've showed you guys before, my red um, Marmont quilted one. Why does the screen look like yellow? Did that look yellow to you just now? Did that like change colors? It's like making the color weird. Why is it doing that? I'm done. I'm over it. We're going. Goodbye. Thank you guys so very much for watching this video. I do appreciate it. Uh, feel free to leave a comment in the comment section down below. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And until next time, you guys keep it tight. Talk to you later. Bye.